Oh, hi, Katana. Today I decided to review a book that I actually read for school. The author is Sir William Golding and the book is Lord of the Flies. Lord of the Flies is a classic book about a group of British prep school boys between the ages of 5 and 13 that crash land on an uninhabited island after their plane is shot out of the sky. I will point out that their ages aren't expressly stated in the book, but can be easily concluded based on some of the characters' limited vocabularies and also some of their childish actions. The novel is filled with many symbols and morals, and half the fun of reading the book is trying to piece all the symbols together with their meanings. I think you'll find that many of them are very relatable, even in today's society. I'll be honest, I really enjoyed this book. I think it's a change of pace from other things I've been reading lately, probably because it's celebrating its 60th anniversary this year. Now I realize you probably just cringed, rolled your eyes, and are now thinking, ew, why are you reviewing such an old book? And to you I say, because it was really good. How about I change up the phrase? We all know not to judge a book by its cover. But consider this, why do we sometimes judge a book by its age? I mean, sure, if it's nonfiction, it might be out of style, out of context, and outside of your general area of interest, but Lord of the Flies is fiction, and I didn't find it unenjoyable just because it's a little old. My rating is 4 A's out of 5. I found this book to be educational and also insightful, not only into the era in which it was written, but also into the human era as a whole. There are many mentions in the book to human nature and the evil within. Warning, please be prepared for some graphic descriptions of violence if you read this book. And also, there's a bit of foul language. Remember, it's a group of middle schoolers stranded on an island with no adults to watch over them. Something else you might not know is Lord of the Flies was made into a movie in 1990, starring Balthazar Getty and Chris Furr. If you enjoyed The Hunger Games and Divergent, I think you'll enjoy this book as well, based on the themes of adventure and survival. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to get updates whenever I post a new video. The link to my Twitter will be in the show more section below. Today I want you to comment some of the classics you've read for school. And remember, before you read your next book, see if Anna read it.